So I've got good news and bad news. Good news, I just added a bunch of new action figures to my very important toy collection. And the bad news? There's a slight chance that Toy Man got his hands on them and turned them into weapons. And by slight, I mean definite. Justice League, come out and play! Uh, they're called bot bots, and I've been collecting them since I was a kid, so hundreds. Take them out before they do any more damage. What? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh. You can't blow these up! They're 1985 Generation 1 bot bots! No! Those are Generation 4! The first ones with articulating limbs! My die-cast metal Generation 6 bot box. So what are we supposed to do? Gently put them back in the boxes. Too late, Tin Man. They lose value every second they're out of the original packaging. <laughs> no! Now I think you'll find my next. Wait, is that the Japanese version of the G6 die-cast bot box? Yeah, I got it at the convention. Oh, it's a convention special. I didn't know they made it. I mean, <coughs> these aren't the only toys that like to play rough. I bring my newest plaything with explosives powerful enough to take out your watchtower. Stand down or I push the button. No, no, you won't. You can't. Because that is a G3 International 1982 bot bot, one of only five in existence and in mint condition. No true toy lover would ever harm it. You're so right. The stencil detailing, the axle variation. How could I destroy perfection? I also had the place in. Get out! So, do we arrest him now? I'm just gonna leave and pretend this never happened. Those are G4 articulated limbs? Actually, yes, they are. That's a very good eye. 